flashlight? There's a branch that comes off. The heck? Why the heck? Oh, I must have been the shrine. This guy replaces my golem. The shards of the epoch are calling you the statue, but nothing is here. Ooh. Reactivate the bridge device. start pumping into spirit leech we capping that puppy we definitely are and then we're gonna drop down and get our owing armor so we're gonna cap this puppy next six levels for that We're gonna hop up here. The Fellfire. Tormenting an ignited enemy <clears throat> spreads all your ignite stacks from it to a number of other enemies around. Okay. Just one there, and then up here. Torment deals more damage to ignited, poisoned, or bleeding enemies. That's capped. So we're gonna hop down here. Soul of Raid, spirits move faster and deal more damage. Death has come. 
Come down here. No, no. two shards in your possession resonate with power. The last shard lies ahead. Taking it will reform the epoch. After eons alone, three again become one. On the precipice of a broken world, there is hope. The epoch is reforged. As the traveler left, the real journey began. Mm. Already got one of these, but might be able to trade for it later. Well, let's do one for set items. I believe we have identified when the void began to sweep over the world and who is likely responsible. The year 1005 in the Imperial Era. What do I need to do? Centuries before the world was ruined, it faced a different threat. The Immortal Empire. They were once human, but their dark magic twisted them into a vile mockery of life. These undead fiends hunted the living at the whim of the immortal Emperor. We believe that it was his greed for power that unleashed the void upon the world. Stopping him is our best chance at changing fate. How can I get there? The Epoch will guide your way. It knows the weavings of fate far better than any of us. Seek out the Outcast Queen, leader of the living rebels, and show her the Epoch. The rest will be up to you. I'm ready.
Mm. The Outcast Queen. Welcome to our humble camp of Outcasts. If you mean to join the rebellion, you're in good company. If not, well, then you've just made a poor choice coming here. Good company, I assure you. Here. A shark. Wait, no, the whole epoch. I'm here to stop the immortal emperor. I mean, yes, the epoch should be the key we've needed, but... Well, you're impressive, I'll give you that. I'm here to help however I can. Assuming we trust you, if you get the epoch close to the emperor, we might be able to use this power against him. One of our mages had the location to a secret entrance for his base, but he's been captured. They're transporting him west, somewhere in Weldrin. I'll head there now. Yes, I see. You call that armor? If you want to stand a chance against the Immortal Empire, you're going to need better gear. Head to the forge and view yourself with some shards. Thank me later. Stay safe. This is the forge. Use the forge in the outcast camp. So I used it. I didn't use it on the weapon I'm using. But, um. Probably want to save stuff until we get to. Yeah, 70 plus equipment. What do you want? So you're the outsider. The queen told us to expect you. Or good things, I hope. She said we should help you out. Thing is, I'd like to know we can trust you. See that Imperial over there? He had keys to the Great College. Use them to infiltrate the place and stop whatever they're going over there. You're not the only person wanting to get there, you know. The college was one of the first... The Immortal Empire took from us. Always wanted to see what's inside. See what I can hmm. do do. Each hat. I got thirty thousand. Is there a gambler in town? No, no gamblers. <clears throat> All right, gang. I think I'm gonna crash. Call it a night here. I can't recall how far we are through the campaign. 
Because some things have changed from what I've seen so far from way back when I played it before. But we'll find out tomorrow. All right, gang. That's it for me tonight. Tomorrow we'll continue our campaign run. Uh, and we'll be playing that uh, pretty, pretty much the last teapot for the next week or so. If there's something you want to play uh, in the future, let me know. I'll do a first look and review of it and see if you guys like it before you buy it. It's kind of what I want to do with this channel. Uh, I also want to get a good community going so we can do multiplayer games. Because that's my beef. I love playing games with other people. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Have a good one. Have a good night. And I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.